Okay, so this is the view from Burn Bank Fell. Looking around to the coast. Nothing more than a grassy mound is this really. As you can see, a little bit featureless. Uh, Grassmore's looking good over there though. And this is looking around to Blake Fell, where I'm heading off to next. So nothing too much to see. Moving on. Okay, we're on uh, Blake Fell now. And it's pretty windy up here. Even I've put the old beanie on. It's nearly July. Um, that's where I've just come from. Uh, glimpses of crummock water just down there and grass more. I'm off to Gavel Fell over that way now. Quite a few high fell distance there. Uh, and then just looking around to the coast. It does look like streaks of rain over there. So fingers crossed it doesn't come this way. It is an easterly wind so it should be okay. Uh, and there we have it. The Blakefell panorama. Right, this is Gavel Fell. Uh, looking out over to the coast. Uh, it's looking like rain over there. See it streaking down. But dry here so far. Uh, that's looking back to Blake Fell. Around to Whiteside and Grassmoor, Melbreak, just in front, Hencombe there, um, and then that's Stybarrow Dodd there, I think. Uh, and that's Great Bourne, where I'm heading next. So, hopefully, it'll stay dry. Um, hopefully, I'm intending to make camp somewhere around Great Bourne. See how far I get. It's a bit windy though, so if it stays as windy as this, I might have to drop down uh, to find a bit of shelter. Uh, we'll see. Lovely uh, sun streaks over there. Anyway. Great Bourne now, uh, and I'm heading off to Starling Dodd next, which is the one there in the foreground, Red Pike and uh, High Crag in the background, High Style rather in the background. Great Gable there, Pillar, Scope Fell, Steeple, Haycock. And the view around to the coast. Enadale, Enadale Water is just over that side. Uh, sun's threatening to creep through, about another two hours off sunset. That's just looking back at the route that I've come so far. And all the way back round again to Grassmoor. Robinson over there. There we have it. Just wandered over to the Ennerdale side of Great Bourne. But I'm glad I did because I couldn't see Ennerdale water from the summit from, from down here. Look at that. See the whole length of Ennerdale water. Cracking view. Well worth the little detour. 
just up there. Off to Starling down there. On Starling Dodd Summit now, looking over to Red Pike. It's a bit of evening sun now, just uh, dappling the fells over there. Rain is forecast though. And a dale water. There's the sun peeping through. Looking back to the Great Horn. Right, off to find camp now. summit of Hencombe, the last fell of the little trip. Just looking back down to Lowe's Water down there where the car's parked. Uh, and then you can see all the fells I've climbed. Uh, Lake Fell. Gavel Fell. Sky Barrow Dodd, then just camped just down to the right of there. Uh, and uh, wandered up here. Just see Pillar in Cloud over there. Well, just creeping in and out of Cloud. Red Pike similarly creeping in and out of Cloud there. View down to Buttermere. And then again, there's Cloud just shrouding Robinson. And the Grassmoor Fells as well. Lovely sunset over there this morning. Uh, Melbrake just in the foreground there. And then all the way back round again. So that's the lot. Gonna head back down there now. Should be about an hour back to the car. Uh, and then the mission is, it's now just quarter to seven. The mission is to get back to Preston for half past ten to see the lad playing football. Should easily do that, I reckon. Signing off.